This technique is for the thoracic erectors. The patient is lying on their side. We have their hands interlocked behind their neck, supporting the spine, allowing us to then use their arms as a lever to take them into extension. If they're unable to do this because they have shoulder pain or hand or wrist pain, there are alternatives that we can do, seated or prone. From here, what I'm gonna do is we're going to palpate through the thoracic erectors. I'm going to just place my hand underneath and you'll notice my shoulder is just pushing into the underside of the arm, creating this very gentle extension. Now, as we palpate through and we find that position of pain, we would apply pressure to it. Then I'm gonna place the, move, the patient into certain positions. We can start off with some extension, we can start off with some side bending, we can start off with some rotation, and you'll notice we're gonna take them through various different angles until we find that position of ease. Once we've found it, we can then relax the hand off and let the symptoms subside. Once the symptoms have subsided, this is a great opportunity to then reinforce those mechanisms by applying gentle pressure through the thoracics, through the rib cage, towards the shoulder girdle, and just start to gently maybe circumduct, extend, flex, side bend, lovely thoracic movements, all controlled to help to reduce that discomfort and improve that quality and quantity of movement into this thoracic area. If the patient says they're experiencing some discomfort, we stop, put them back into neutral, apply compression and then reposition them into the position of ease. Let things subside after 60 to 90 seconds. Then we can go back into our general soft rhythmical movement to mobilize the area.